So he daylights the field here, at least for the moment. With eight cars yet to make their run. That'll bring up Camry Caruso for Tequila Commissario. Camry, who's out at a local establishment here, I believe last night, meeting and greeting and signing autographs and meeting the fans and sharing tequila stories because, well, everybody's got a tequila story. Everybody. Come on. We're at the zoo, Alan. Big Jeff, stereo, power built tools, all working with Camry, the former rookie of the year, and Aaron Stanfield over on the right side. The Janik Brothers and JC3 Energy. That's a car that comes out of the Elite trailer. It's like hanging out on vacation. You know, his wife's here, kids here. Aaron Stanfield needs to kind of make a move here, I think, if he wants to make a move into the countdown of the championship. Currently sitting seventh in points. Yeah, I think that's probably a little surprising that Aaron Stanfield is that far down. He's number three runner in the world a year ago. And it just they've not had the consistency this year that they had last year. It seemed like last year they were uh, locked for the semifinals almost every week of the year. That's just not been the case this year. Camry Caruso, of course, winner out in Phoenix earlier this year, 19th woman to win a Camping World Series professional race across the ranks. And she's had some weekends this year where she's been very difficult as well. Both drivers solid, if not spectacular, on the incremental numbers. 662, 206, Aaron Stanfield. 663, 206, Camry Caruso. Christian Quadra is going to stay number one. A.A. Ron is two, Camry Caruso. Three, Kyle Koretsky. That's your four show-offs in the field so far.